Hello everyone, so me. I'm here with YX. Hello. You just won the newcomers award. Yeah. To, uh, I did. The did. demo scene thing. So you're a new, you're a new demo sceneer. Hooray! How has that roller coaster been for you so far? It's been it's been pretty good. <laughs> pretty good. Like I've only released what four pro? Well, three prods and an XE graphics. If you, if you count this one. Yeah. Four, okay. Fine. Yeah. Four prods if we count the ones I've just released. But you've been doing a lot of uh, shader showdown stuff as well. Yes. Yeah. That's. Yeah. I, I kind of. I got the itch. And I wanted to be doing kind of more sceny stuff, but I but couldn't be getting to. I, it was it's expensive to get to demo parties. You, and your revision wasn't for months, so I started doing this, this streaming on Twitch just for just to kind of scratch that itch. And yeah, I think it's working out really well. Yeah, I mean, mo when I see your your live streams, I usually assume that you're like practicing for the shader showdown. Yeah, I, I think it's it's partly practicing for the showdown and partly just kind of using it as a creative outlet. Do you reuse the stuff that you do on your live streams on the on any productions that you do afterwards for the demo scene? Uh, a little bit. There's kind of a sequence at the very start of uh, Brainworm, recycled bits of a shader that I done on a stream a few months ago. Uh -huh. um, but for the most part, I don't recycle it. Okay, but just that's kind of little bits here and there. That's a shame. But you were already quite into shader coding before you got into the demo scene, right? Yeah. Yeah. I heard you were recruited by Subi. Can you tell Recru us? Recruited is a strong word. <laughs> <laughs> Can you tell us that story, or is it, or is it yeah, not sure. that interesting? No. It, it, so January of last year, um, Subi, like, he already knew that I was interested in the demo scene. He already knew that I was being doing kind of remarching in my free time, that kind of stuff. Um, and so he wanders over to my desk at work and just says, "Hey, revisions in three months. Do you want to go? <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna do something." And I said, "Yeah, sure. Let's, let's do it. I'll, I'll go." Well, then, why, did you try, why did you try to do something for the Mac? That's not what you usually... Well, okay, it's fine. Not, it's not a very good platform to do size coding. <laughs> no, not at all. I, I figured I was, I figured whatever I made, I would be panicked finishing it at the party. <laughs> and the only laptop I had at the time was a Mac, and so that was the only reason for that choice. You, you can do a boot camp on a Mac and have Windows running on it. You yeah, do but that, that. that takes effort, and I'm like, so... <laughs> you better but optimize... This year... This year there was an effect I really wanted to do that I had to use compute shaders for, and uh -huh. compute support on Mac is really bad. So I moved to Windows, they, they, and I went and bought a new laptop just for that prop. Aren't they like down, downgrading the WebGL and OpenGL support to force people to go to use Metal? Um, I don't Something know that they're downgrading it. They've kind of they've announced that it's deprecated. Which basically means it will work for now, but it might stop working at some indeterminate point in the future. Yeah. And you really should use metal. So. Yeah. Um, and, uh, anyways, I was going to ask you about the uh, Meteoric Award. So you yeah. won the Newcomer Award. What I did? did you, what it was did you... terrifying being up on stage. <laughs> <laughs> Were you expecting it? I was. I was hopeful, but not expecting. Okay. I was. You know. I, I was. Genu I genuinely thought Slurpee had a very solid chance of winning. I still absolutely think that if he had one, he would absolutely have deserved it. He had a very good entry. Yeah. So. Yeah. Um, what did you yeah. think of the other competition? Did you check the other people besides Slurpee? Um, I did. I didn't really see them as kind of up to the same bar, but um, I don't know. That's just my opinion, and I'm sure it's, they would think differently on that. And it's, apologies. It's fine. <laughs> but. Uh, what else, what else do I want to ask you? So just about the, the Meteorics overall, you already talked about the competition. So uh, how are you enjoying the demo scene so far? Do you feel welcome? Absolutely, yeah. To, uh, it's an incredibly welcoming space. What, is there any words you would like to say to people who are trying to get into the demo scene and feel like a bit overwhelmed that they might not be like up to par to the standard of quality or whatever you want to call it? Sure. Ignore the standard quality. <laughs> just, just make something. Make something. Have fun doing it. That's the important thing. Just make something cool. Have fun doing it, and eventually you will get better. That's that's all you need to know. Yeah, that's, awesome. that's it. Thank you very much. Yeah, no worries.